Have you ever wondered, how did I come to be? Why do living organisms need to give birth to younger ones of their own kind? One very important reason is that all living things grow and after a definite period of time, they die. But before death, they try to continue their species by giving birth to organisms like themselves using a process known as reproduction. This process takes place with the help of a system known as the reproductive system. The reproductive system of living organisms have different structures and characteristic features that make the process of reproduction for the continuity of that race of group possible. The young ones also feed, grow, and reproduce again. For example, in humans, the male reproductive system is different from that of the females. The male reproductive system consists of structures like the testes that produce the sperm, which is the male sex cell, and the penis, which is for the introduction of the sperm into the vagina of the female animal. The female reproductive system consists of the ovaries that produce the egg, which is the female sex cell, the womb, also called the uterus, where the embryo develops and the vagina that receives the sperm and also serves as the birth canal. Enjoy and see you in the next class.